G'day guys, what's cracking? Two Aussie here again. So today we're going into Big Daddy's and we're going to check out Big Daddy's 14 inch hot dog, believe it or not. It's just across the road here. I'm going to head in there in a minute. Now this is American style burger joint. It's got a 3.8 star Google rating. Not very high, but um, some of these things are a bit pricey, but I'm going in because I haven't had a hot dog in a minute and this thing like I said, 14 inches long. I can't believe it. So we're going to go in, grab something a little bit outrageous today. We're going to do something a little bit different. We're not going to skimp on the price. This thing's going to be 15 bucks, apparently. We'll find out more when we go in there. Well, they sell things like also Dr. Pepper, um, ANW root beer. So who knows? We might get a drink, but they are about four bucks each or something. This is going to be a bit of a pricey one, but we're going to do something a little bit outrageous today. 14 inches long. Can you believe it? Hopefully we can get it. Now on the hot dog, it's got bacon, a beef con carne, like a chili con carne type thing, sour cream, uh, cheese, and a Big Daddy mayo. So never, no idea what Big Daddy, Daddy mayo tastes like, but I guess it's exclusive to Big Daddy's, isn't it? So let's go and check it out and grab this 14 inch long hot dog. Okay, here we go. As you can see, not the best day <laughs> to be doing this, but you got to do what you got to do. Got the tray. Now, our preferred drink today is, I wasn't expecting this, Cherry Coca-Cola. <laughs> nice purple can there. Of course, it's probably just going to taste, well, it's going to look like Coca-Cola probably, but the star of the show, yeah. the size of that thing. So let's get it out. The big reveal. It smells fantastic, I'll tell you that. So, there it is, your 14 inch home wrecker hot dog. Oh, just don't ask. I don't know why it says that, just don't ask, but I won't. Let's open it up and check it out. <laughs> Yikes. Now, I could smell that chili on there. It's pretty good. Now, do I take it out of the box? Do I leave it in the box? What do I do? This is one of those times where you just don't know what to do, but you love to see it. <laughs> so, first of all, I'm wondering, should I measure it? Make sure it is 14 inches. You know what? I think the answer to that is yes. Why don't we? Let's put it this way so you can see it. 
I'm not going to touch it because I don't want that all over the place. Oh, yeah, it's 14 inches. I'll put it there. Actually, I'll put it there. Now, let's move this. It's all going to be complicated now. So, let's check it out. From there to there. It's actually a little bit over 14 inches. So, we've done it right there. 14 inches. There you go. So, good stuff from Big Daddy's. We should tuck in and see what it's like. I'll tell you, I really am serious. I don't know what to do here. <laughs> it's everywhere. What to do, what to do. This is going to go everywhere. But I have got some napkins, so that's one good thing. So in case I didn't mention it earlier, 15 bucks. No, I can't even pick that up. Actually, you know what? Maybe we can do it this way. Let's try this. Maybe this will work. Definitely don't want this all over the car. Whoa, look at that. Oh, that must be the Big Daddy special sauce. Big Daddy sauce, whatever it is. Let's tuck in. I can't wait. Man. The actual hot dog itself tastes fantastic. I don't know what to do. I'm speechless. This is just horrendous. Don't think we're going to be using that. So we'll get rid of the knife. I can't cut it, it's so soggy anyway. We'll do our cherry cola. Well, I think about plan B. Well, I don't usually have a plan B, but continue with this plan. It's not each twice so far. It looks good. I already know a can fits in this cup, so I might as well not muck around pouring it in. So that's your purple can of Coke. Cherry, good stuff. <sighs> Beautiful. I just can't eat this. I need some sort of utensils. You know what? Maybe if I eat both sides, then we can eat the middle. This is just unbelievable. How do you? Have you ever seen anything like that? Wow. I'm not going to lie, I did think there'd be less on there than this, less chili con carne and all the rest of it, and I was expecting I'm not going to give it a really good score for value, and for taste it's fantastic, I love it. So let's start off with taste. For taste I'm going to give it 5 out of 5, it's a beauty. For mess I'm going to give it 5 out of 5 too. <laughs> It's unbelievable how messy this thing is. But I guess I was sort of expecting that, but not to this degree. Well, you know, I'm going to have to try and get it out of there and lick it off the paper later on. Let's try it again. But anyway, for value, I'm going to give it four, out, four and a half out of five. I actually didn't expect it was going to be that good. And look at that. What a bloody mess. But you know what, I didn't realise till I just picked that up now. It's actually two hot dogs in there. Look at that. Oh, that's alright. That's why it's 14 inches. There you go. Check that out. Let's see if we can eat that bit. And then, you know what, things might get a bit easier. So I feel like I'm getting on top of this thing now. <laughs> it was getting on top of me to start with. We've only got a bit of hot dog in there, the actual dog. Let's try with our, all the other stuff. It's not bad, I may be pretty full after this. There's a decent sized hot dog in there, pretty thick, pretty good. 
I was expecting just a normal red sort of, you know, standard hot dog type thing. But it was good and it tasted good too. The chili, the con carne, which I'm guessing is chili con carne, it tastes a bit chili. Great combo. And cheese, sour cream, bacon, winner winner, hot dog dinner. Well, I've conquered Big Daddy's home wrecker. Why well, it's called home wrecker? It says don't ask. I'm not going to ask because I have no idea why it would be called that. The cherry cola. Let's have another sip. Got so many flavors going on now. Cherry cola, chili con carne, all this stuff. I'm surprised I haven't spilled one bit on my shirt yet. <laughs> I shouldn't speak too soon. It might happen. So that's my first time trying that cherry cola flavor. It's actually nice. I probably prefer that to even vanilla and I don't mind vanilla so that's pretty good. And that was four bucks for that can. I suppose you're going to expect to pay a little bit in a place like that. Four bucks is alright I guess. Um, so 19 bucks all up for the whole thing. Not too outrageous. I thought it was going to be less than I got. So it's it's not bad. It's pretty eats well. And for taste, I'll probably give that four out of five. Same for value. So that's our giant hot dog. Still got a bit of a dog in there. It's one hell of a wiener, wasn't it? So there are a few of these places around. This one's at Penrith. I have seen there's a couple in the city type area. I think there's one actually King's Cross, but I'm don't, not 100% sure. There's one in Darlinghurst or Oxford Street. And there's a couple of other places. You can find them if you want. I don't know. I would say they're only in New South Wales. Couldn't see any in other, any other states, but don't quote me on that. So, guys, I recommend you get in there and try something like this. If you feel up to it. And they had burgers, fries, all sorts of things. Curly fries, loaded fries, all sorts of stuff going on. Not an easy one to wrap your laughing gear around, but I'm so glad I tried this today. It's a winner. And there's still more on the paper. Love it. So, Big Daddies, give it a crack. If you can. Totally good, well. Can't waste it. <laughs> Far out. I've probably got a spoon there somewhere, like a KFC spoon, but I won't look for it now. Just trying to lick it off the bloody off the paper. There's not much left now. I'm surprised I got through it. I did alright with this one guys. I was a bit worried. Good thing they gave me a lot of serviettes. <laughs> oh, I do have a lot in the glove box anyway. Any on the shirt? Nah, did alright. Just all over my hands. That's your Big Daddy's home wrecker. Just don't ask. Bit my buns. I don't know what that's all about. There was a sign in there saying pimp my buns. Maybe I'll get my bums pimped, my buns, I said bums, maybe I will get my buns pimped one day. Who's your daddy? <laughs> That's the home wrecker from Big Daddy's. Managed to polish that off, I'm very surprised, I didn't think I'd get through it, but I haven't eaten today, so that's cool. Probably won't eat again now after that. That was a beauty. It was lit, and I was loving it. Now guys, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. That's a bloody messy thumbs up. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And remember, you can never be too Aussie. Hooroo. Who's your daddy? Pimp my buns. <laughs> Let me know, guys, if you want to see me get my buns pimped.
Stay fresh.